Good morning. Um, Saturday, March 17th. I got up um, and sat down, recorded two episodes of Dungeon Siege 2. Got those converting now, so that's good. Um, now that I'm not so stressed out with being behind on vlogs, able to put a little time into the video game channel. I want to get that back to a point where it's caught up enough where I'm at least putting out a video every week. Because <laughs> right now I'm not. Uh, but yeah, so made a step forward with that, so that's good. Uh, otherwise I've heard from Nick we might do something food whether just hibachi grill or something new, I'm not sure, but um, we might do something today. But yeah, just uh, got things. <laughs> Woke up and I was like, gotta do video games, and now I'm like, all right, now what do I do? I've, I've finished that, or I've done some more of that, and you know, I can only record so much, and then I gotta convert the files and delete the huge ones, so. But yeah, otherwise, good morning. And yeah, sounds like we're just going to go to a bocce grill, but Nick and Ryan should be here any moment to do so. It'll be fun. Here at a bocce grill for Ryan and Nicholas. Yeah. And just got the same thing as traditional, not trying anything new this time, not being risky, not making mistakes, not messing up the plate of food. Just stick with what you know. Right? He's just gonna smile there. Nick came over after we ate. Cause he wants. So fucking Cause he wants me to <laughs> build the chair so that when we game, he can have a spinny, cushy chair as well instead of the hard wood chair that he's been using. So I guess I'll actually start working on it. And this chair is basically something you've all seen when I made that one, except it's black on both sides. This time around, I know going in that there are parts stored in the back side of the chair and I don't have to be really confused with, wait, where are the rest of the parts? It's like, eh. Because they're in there. <laughs> that really confused me the first time I went through it. New chair. All black, pretty chair. Matches the room nicer, I think. Yeah, Nick, that's exactly why I built a new chair. Hey, you haven't said it. <laughs> <laughs> Nick has uh, fought this weird fire crotch guy multiple times now, but his continues are going low enough that I'm not sure if he'll manage. Did you just kill it? Yeah. No, no, that up dagger thing's worthless. <laughs> oh, okay, he switched <laughs> weapons, and apparently, apparently the previous weapon wasn't doing much damage. Okay. Yeah, no, he, he fought the thing for like five minutes without killing it before, and now he just, that was quick. <laughs> now he's to a spot he's never been, so. And his continues Come out are of the low. wall! Yeah, his continues are low, so I'm not sure if he'll make it much further. Ah! Oh no! You're, you're doomed. I don't remember you! It's it's the same boss, but in the next level. To be fair, I'm pretty sure he's the final boss too. So what, they just... They just get At some point they... Oh like, god! <laughs> they just gave up on making new bosses and decided, we'll just use this one several times. To be fair, he's got a new form. Okay, yeah, it's mildly different. I... Oh, oh no! <laughs> <laughs> oh god! His penis fire got so long! <laughs> <laughs> the guy has two faces, and the lower one said it breathes fire. The lower one also happens to be on his crotch. It's like, what's the guy from, uh, Turtles? Uh, Krang. Krang and the robot that Krang is it. yeah. Yes. <laughs> I 
Last credit if you don't earn another. It's getting close. Yeah. But we have arrows now. Yes, yeah, you, you got your weapon back, so we'll see. <laughs> you didn't Good exactly time. have a lot of time either, yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I was watching that car. What? Oh, Arthur. I'm so glad you came to help me. But not even you can defeat that fiend, Saradus, without the goddess. Bracelet. Okay. Also, I don't think I've mentioned this. Now, I need to go back and do the thing again. This time, finding the goddess bracelet. The whole... Wait, you're at, you're at level one. You're, that's, that's level one. Yeah. Wait, what? Uh, some games now put in artificial link thing with mini games and other stuff. Go do the game again. Find this one item. Get back here. <laughs> So they just send you back to the beginning? Yeah. Now I have a <laughs> chance to spawn the goddess bracelet in chess. Yeah, sure. You know what? Yeah, no, I count that as victory. Good job, Nick! You won! <laughs> that's, like, that's like saying that when you beat the nuclear throne in nuclear throne and it takes you back to it again, like you didn't win. No, no, you won. <laughs> the game restarted. <laughs> Wow, it just sends you back to level one. Mm hmm. You don't so have the goddess stupid. bracelet. So stupid. Well, good game design would have made sure that you had a chance to find the goddess bracelet that first time around. <laughs> stupid. <laughs> I love how much you dislike this game <laughs> because it's just not a game for you. Me, it's like awesome. Now I can do this again, except better, and get a goddess bracelet that has unknown properties. The properties is it lets you beat the game when you beat the game. It gives you a different ending screen. Actually, it gives me access to another boss fight with the giant cock flaming monster. I think he has more forms. <laughs> of course he does, why not? I'm sure it's a palette swap as well. Mm -hmm. Really, they could have at least just made it where every world from here on has a bit of a palette swap. Tried to make that, just do something like that to make it at least feel like they're... <laughs> You've got far enough. <laughs> No, I haven't. <laughs> uh, I will beat this game. Sounds like he wants more punishment at a later day. <laughs> hey, that means I'm gonna have like 14 credits by the time I hit the end. <laughs> yeah. That game looks so punishing. It's so I bad. Love it. No, no. It, it is the right amount of punishing where, yes, their games in the future will do better. But it's, yes, it is punishing, but more often than not, it's your fault. I mean, some of them, yes, there's definitely, you couldn't have known this, bad things. But a lot of it's, so when I do beat it like that, I feel so good. <laughs> Making an awesome jump in between projectiles with that locked th thing. What, my hair stupid? <laughs> no, the light, you bump the light. <laughs> <laughs> Adios, my friend. See you. So I spoke with my mom. My nephew's over. They're ordering pizza, so we'll have something to eat. And I'm going to go over there. I'm going to play a game. I had to ask him, is he looking to play a, just a short game or a longer game? He says just a short game, so I'm not going to bother bringing D&D &D stuff. But, uh, yeah, still, all the same, we'll be playing something. That'll be fun. I see you had yourself uh, some of drink and uh, just a bottle of ketchup. Straight, that's that's delicious. It's a healthy meal. Healthy meal? Just, just, okay. Guess it's good for on the go. Convenient squirt bottle. So, we uh, we had some pizza, and that was good. And now, 
I'm going to play a game. He doesn't want to play something too long. So it sounds like what he wants to play is Carcassonne. Which, I guess it's been a bit since we played that, so that'll be fun. Ethan, as the youngest, you're first, so we're waiting on you. Yeah, baby. He's playing WoW. <laughs> He's always playing WoW. Ethan has made the silliest of roads. Where are you going on that road? It's for exercise. Oh, no, it's, a, it's a jogging path. Yeah. <laughs> you have four points. Four point jogging path. We're pretty close to being done. And mom is about to lap us. <laughs> yeah, but when you count all your points, you're going to go over the board three times. Never yeah, that's an optimistic that. viewpoint. We'll, we'll see how that works out. <laughs> so, we each made it more than once around the board, but you're still significantly further ahead than us. Really? Yes. <laughs> I thought you were just going to whoop my pants. No, I was like, uh, <laughs> what is that? Eight points behind you. <laughs> no, I had a lot of little, little farm, you know, little cities to, to sell my crops to with my farmer, but... You had a very commanding lead, a, basically a 50 point lead before the end of the game. You were around the board ones. Wow. So. All those monasteries, they really rake in the money. Yes, when you get monastery after monastery, yeah. <laughs> it was just a fun game. It's nice seeing some family. Um, left there, came home. Sat down to do, I don't know, uploading or editing or something, but no, I'm tired. And really, I gotta try and shift my schedule back to, uh, to some more normal. So, it's almost 9.30, I better go to bed. Thank you for, for joining me and joining me as my journey continues. Bye. <laughs>